Wow, well that was, uh, yeah, I think that's my best uh, Morpheus experience so far. So you've just seen Project Morpheus. What do you think? Was it good? Was it big? Was it clever? It was all of those things, Excellent. actually, and more. Um, it, was, it was very good. It impressed me more than I thought it was. I was slightly sceptical about VR on a console, and I'm no longer. Um, it, it was very good. I mean, I've tried, so I've tried Oculus up to the HD version, but I haven't tried Crystal Cove. So I, I thought can you really only... liked it. So the Oculus stuff. I love the Oculus, and yeah. the Oculus is great as well. I'm not. The thing is, I haven't tried Crystal Cove, so I can't compare. But from um, people on the team who have tried Crystal Cove and Morpheus, they yeah. say that you know it, it's very similar, okay. um, and that, that doesn't surprise me at all. But yeah, I mean, the design of it's the thing that struck me first of all because Oculus is a bit, still a bit, bit stuck together on your face. Um, this is a good. Exactly yeah, I mean, it's still is. a prototype, and they said, that, yeah, it, it's, it's going to change, but um, it's nice, you know, there's like a head strap, a cool blue light that looks very futuristic for yeah. tracking, and um, but obviously that's not the important thing, because when you're wearing it, you can't see that. The important thing is the VR itself is very, very good. Like, um, I mean, it was very fast, you know, there's no latency, it was, um, it was using a 1080p display, which is clear enough, I think. I mean, you know, there's... Maybe people want more than that, but I actually think it's enough. How does it feel it when you're in it, like in terms of taking to be displayed? So, you, what's, what would it compare to in terms of looking at a screen? <sighs> it's very difficult to compare it to anything VR, yeah. and I think this is a problem a lot of people find at the moment. To describe VR is it, it's hard. I feel bad for Sony and Oculus trying to sell it to people without just saying try it. It's yeah. a bit like Google Glass, but like ten times worse because like you really do just have to just try it to yeah. completely understand it. Um, so I tried some demos. I tried one called The Deep, which was actually my favorite, where you're put into a uh, diving cage and you're sent down into the sea. Um, and uh, the thing that was struck me that was brilliant at the, at the start was actually, because you've got the controller, which has a tracker on it as well, and the headset, and it's yeah. been tracked on the PlayStation camera, you could actually um, kind of do a kind of squat when you're standing and you're, you'd look down and your, your knees would actually bend. Wow. And it was actually quite cool. Um, and that so fu that functionality was built into the PlayStation from the start, apparently. Well, it, it was um, so the VR team they made sure that the blue light on the DualShock 4 was there for tracking. We just didn't know that that's what it was actually for. It's got us some other uses as well, but actually they were the ones that said to Sony, "Look, we need this for Project Morpheus." And then when it came out, everyone was like, "Well, it's a blue light. I can't turn it off." And everyone, the VR team, were like, "We can't say what it's for, but yeah. it's for this." Um, so that's all going on at the same time. But yeah, the deep was cool. You kind of go down and you're in a thing and then uh, the sharks kind of going around you and starting to tear up the cage. And there oh. were moments where I was like... Were they real sharks? What do you mean, real sharks? So, well, they weren't real. They felt like they were real. Like they virtual. felt like... Well, for a minute. Forever. Yeah, you yeah, see, this I is the thing. Virtual reality happened. and reality. Yeah. They made me do all the diagram again. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, like a couple of moments I was like... Apparently, when I, yeah. when I took it yeah. off, I was yeah. like, oh, they're not real. Yeah. I thought see. I was actually in the cage. But no, they, it was terrifying for a couple of moments you know there was a bit at the end where the shark ripped the actual side of the cage off and was coming from it but didn't like, really do it because it wasn't it no was but at the time it. i thought it was real yeah, gotcha and then yeah. i worked it out um and then there was eve valkyrie which is great space simulators everything you wanted as a kid yeah virtual reality in space brilliant very clear on the 1080p display just looked gorgeous i actually felt a bit funny in my stomach when I did some barrel rolls, yeah. which was a good sign. It means I was well immersed into the technology. Yeah. Um, so yeah, and there's this other, the castle demo as well, which is very cool, which actually used PlayStation Move. So I was using that to um, pick up some swords. So you'd use the triggers yeah. as grips and it felt quite, it, very quickly I felt very immersed. Like I was picking up these swords and I was attacking this guy there was a dragon. There was so much stuff yeah. going on there, man. <laughs> Sounds but like you're really living the dream. It was. <laughs> it is. It's. Th this is the thing with VR, and I've had this with Oculus. You get. You try. It's, like, it's amazing, but you can't really describe it to someone unless they've actually tried. You know, yeah. you really have to see it to believe it. As cliche as that statement. And you did realise the whole way through that you weren't actually doing it, though. Yeah, but I, yeah. I was for a bit. I mean, you weren't actually stabbing a man with. No, but for a bit I thought it was. Yeah. And then I came out. I mean, how is that real? Yeah. Thank like goodness I listened to Gareth's advice. Yeah. It's not real. Yeah. So yeah, Project Morpheus, in conclusion, very, very good. I'm excited to see, um, well, I'm just excited to see it eventually get to the market, but I'm like what Sony's doing. They're doing the Oculus thing. They're saying, we're not gonna rush it. We're gonna make sure it's good. It'll probably go through some more iterations at yeah. prototype stage. Good. And, you know, maybe we'll see it in a year. I don't know. Hopefully at a price point that, you know, we can afford. Mm -hmm.